Hey guys, how you doing? Today I'm gonna to review a couple products that K Tactical sent me. These guys are, I kinda of like these guys because they seem to like anime just as much as me and that just makes them a hundred times cooler. So the two products that they sent me today was these carbon fiber sunglasses and this Damascus steel pocket katana knife, which I really like. But I put on the carbon fiber sunglasses yesterday and wore them around and I'm, yeah, I like them a lot. They are real lightweight, but they, they seem real strong too in the sense that they're not going to break, you know, doing just mundane things. Another little aspect that I like about them is that they have the adjustable nose pieces. Sometimes glasses doesn't fit my big nose the way I want them to and these little nose pieces will help fit them securely to my big ass nose. <clears throat> it says they are triacetate cellulose polarized UV 400 protection lens. So, you know, whatever that means, I'm sure it's good because when I look through them, they look really nice. Let's see if you can see. Of course you can. It looks different than that though. Only time will tell if they'll hold up. I'll be sure to report back on their durability when I wear them for a little while. But so far, I like them. Now the thing I like the most is this little pocket knife. It is called the Folding Pocket Katana Samurai Japanese Carry Knife. And it's also got carbon fiber on the outside right here. If you Take your little thing here, push down, the Damascus steel is revealed. And this thing is very handy. I've uh, used it a couple days now and yeah, it just slides right in and out the pocket real nicely. And I'm a fan of um, kind of streamlined tools. And it doesn't get much more streamlined than uh, little baby pocket katana. I'm not really a fidgeter or one to fidget with gadgets and stuff, but uh, that is fun as I don't know what. <laughs> I was never one to do these things with knives, but now I kind of understand the appeal of flicking the blade open really quick and looking cool. You know, you just feel cool when you do it. It's like, shing. Oh yeah, it's very sharp. It can at least cut the hairs on your hand really nicely. Of course, I don't know if this is gonna be picked up. Oh, it's cutting them for sure. I don't know if you can tell. I'm scared to do that. I feel like I'm gonna slip my wrist. <clears throat> but I really like this knife, so let me read off. Let me read off some of the stats that the knife says. This is the version two of the folding pocket katana. And it features polished Damascus and ceramic ball bearings for, for faster unfolding. The closed length is 4.5 inches and the open length is seven and three quarters. The blade material is high carbon Damascus, Damascus 9CR14MOV with mirror polishing. That's what the stats say. I'm not the one that comes up with these things. There's no serrations on this thing, on this knife. There's no serrations. I don't, I don't like serrations right here. Uh, they're very annoying to me. I want to be able to use the full blade when I'm doing things. So I prefer just blades that have the full straight sharpness. The handle is anodized aluminum and carbon fiber G10 material grips. And they're very nice. These little indentions right here make it to where you're not gonna slip on it easily. Kind of like a katana. Don't cut yourself just looking at it. I've almost done that twice. The little belt loop is also nice and sturdy. Yeah. Clip that on, it's not gonna come off. And you got a little hole 
right there in case you want to attach a lanyard or a string to it let it dangle dingle dangle dangle dingle so yeah this is the folding pocket katana version 2 and so far I'm really liking it it's a uh, I have a few knives but none of them I have felt have been my go-to knife I'm just a fan of katanas to be honest with you and since this one looks like a katana you know it just makes me want to love it even more oh I love to flip it let me see let me see who wants it? Who wants it? You're gonna be like, Whoo. all right, that's enough of that. Now I have I have determined that to close it because most of my knives have always had the serrations right there on the blade, even though I don't like them. Most of my knives just end up having that. Uh, when I close a knife, I have some play because you know the serrations don't really cut you right away. So you can kind of, if your finger slips, right, if you kind of do like this. But with a blade with no serrations right there, you really have to be conscious of when you go to fold it down, let that little hinge touch your thumb. And then instead of just moving it out the way like that and then coming down on top of your fingers that might be right there, just do it like, just do it like this. So you come, you look at, come down and then just move everything and close it like that. That's the safe way to close this knife. So yeah, this is my little review of the couple items that K-Tactical sent me. I really like them guys. They, they're they pretty cool. Uh, they sent this to me as well. And I'm not ashamed to say that I'll probably be using it. If that ain't the coolest looking logo I've ever seen. All right, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Uh, remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you soon.